Hi Gemini, it's Elle here to do your uh, weekly reading. I want to say thank you to those who like, share, comment, subscribe to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. And I hope that everyone is safe and healthy. Okay, so Gemini, um, this week you could be talking... It's not face-to-face -face communication. I feel like somebody's out of the house or out of the, um, just out of the picture. It's not, the relationship needs repair. So someone's not immediately or readily available to talk. So it's communication, uh, maybe, you know, via text or maybe over the phone. It's not face-to-face, -face, okay? And some of you could be talking about the problems in the connection jealousy and, and and someone being greedy greed jealousy just the problems the breakdown of the connection of the intimacy in the connection um intimacy doesn't always mean sex it means like when you're intimate with someone they know every almost everything about you you know you you're open you're an open book uh, and maybe there's a breakdown in that because it looks like there could have been infidelity um, yeah a third person here someone who interfered in the relationship which made another person's heart divided it could be you Gemini it could be the other person I feel like it's you because Or, so it could be you or it could be the other person. It could be a Sagittarius, Aries, Leo, but highlighted on Sagittarius. It could be that this person, the advice here is for you to let this person back in the house so that you can, in the outcome, evaluate them. You can evaluate this relationship, this marriage, this business, or all three, if you have them, uh, and see, and start doing some pruning some real pruning this person will come back and make all kinds of promises to you uh but a leopard doesn't change its spots you know so the cards say that you're going to have to evaluate this relationship you're going to have to reevaluate it you're going to have to look at the seeds planted here will this ever change or will this always be the same you could be dealing with a cancer person um you could be dealing with another Gemini. There, there was or is heavy argument, heavy disagreement, because someone can't get over what happened in the past, the divide, the infidelity in the past. Someone um, wanting up in each other. You know, you cheated, so I'm cheating. You lied, so I lied. Um, things of those natures, where it makes either you Gemini or the other person. Maybe another air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. And it makes them um, it makes you or this other person stuck in cyclical, negative, defeating, lack of confidence type of thoughts where this person is not taking any action because they know that hurt and pain rest here but they also don't know what lies on the other side of ending a relationship ending a marriage so someone someone does nothing yeah so Yeah, this could have been a cheating spouse, someone who was keeping options open, talking to everybody. Uh, Gemini, if this will be you or this will be the other person, but someone is just, you could be done with a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Someone is just making promises, once again, to break them off. They, they don't plan on following through. Someone wants back in, back in the home. 
They just want to come back in the home. There's no real change cards. It's more so let me back in. There is there is need for the both of you to forgive each other and either move on from what happened or move on apart, separate from each other. But there's a, there's op there's a need for you to forgive yourself, Gemini, or vice versa, or um, and forgive this person. There, right now, is sorrow, is hurt, it's pain, whether you're showing it or not. Someone is saying things to get back into your good graces, but do know that little to nothing has changed with this individual or this could be you don't know so Gemini I hope that this reading resonates with you if it does go over to the website book your own reading there uh, take advantage of the coupon codes below uh, if you just have a question or two, you can text your question to the number below. Did I say that you go to the website below to book your reading? Don't go to the number below. Text the number below one question or two or three uh, that you want to ask the tarot cards. Um, you can pay for your question on your mobile device. Receive the answer to your question on your mobile device. Please do not send any text messages to the number of requesting a personal reading that's not how you book one um, go over to the website okay it makes it easier for me easier for you um, most times those messages go unanswered so just go over to the website and all answers will be you know uh, all questions will be answered for you so anyhow Jim and I have a really good week try to anyhow know that forewarning is forearm right so know that you might have to you had a place of introspection introspection and you had a place of evaluating reevaluating this person because they can come again with a lot of promises okay all right Gemini um You might just need to be done with it. You might want to be done with it because there's also someone else here. Okay, Jim and I go over to the website and book readings or text your question to the number below. Take care. Have a really good week.